Back to school is just around the corner for a lot of kids in our area. There is still time, though, to explore some fun and different learning opportunities ahead of the new academic year. Happening today, it's another marvelous Monday at Hershey Gardens, and that's where we find Fox 43 Sedona Meadows live this morning. Good morning, Sedona. Good morning. Yeah, it's a marvelous Monday. I mean, the weather is great right here. I'm surrounded by all these trees, and that's what today's event is all about. It's about trees. Um, but here to talk a little bit more about marvelous Mondays is Rebecca Lawrence, who is the public programs manager here at Hershey Gardens. And Rebecca, tell me a little bit about marvelous Mondays and you know what they're all about. Yeah, so marvelous Mondays runs from 10 to 12 for five Mondays throughout the summer. So our last one is next Monday. But today our theme is about trees, and so we have about five different stations related to trees and then we have an additional two special guests one from the master watershed program from Penn State Extension and the second from the Susquehanna Bonsai Society so it's all about trees today and uh, learning about identification learning about uh, conifers that actually lose their leaves to um, we have a couple arts and crafts related to leaves and trees uh, and more absolutely so it's making education fun right yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so and this isn't just for kids you know parents and grandparents they can they can get involved as well right correct there's something for everyone here when you come to Hershey Gardens yeah definitely so why is it so important for us to learn about you know these kinds of things obviously trees are really important to our environment and then you know throughout Marvelous Monday you have all sorts of, of different topics why is it so important to get kids started at an early age because oh, if you start now hopefully there'll be a lifelong um, enthusiasm and understanding and appreciation for the great outdoors um, and of course if it starts now hopefully it will continue. <laughs> Definitely. So tell me, I know we're right uh, in front of the mother tree. So why is it called the mother tree? <laughs> so the cryptomeria, the dense jade tree that's behind us is called the mother tree because it grew from a witch's broom. And usually if you have this type of growth on your tree, uh, it's not such a good thing. It's usually like a fungal growth, a viral growth. You, you don't really want it, but that's not true in this case. So there was a, a new growth that separated from a cryptomeria uh, with separate DNA from its parent and that was cultivated and now has become the mother tree. So all dense jade trees that are sold in the nursery profession um, can be traced back through its DNA to this tree here. So this is the mother tree. Wow, that is so fascinating. And it's, it's wild to me that, you know, trees have so much history and they, they can be around for so long. Um, so I know that this event starts at 10 a.m. So we're, we're counting down uh, about an hour and a half. So that's exciting. Um, but you guys have other events that are going on here uh, at the gardens coming up later this month in August. We do. So this coming Sunday, Gretna Theater is performing Dr. Seuss's Cat in the Hat at one o'clock and three o'clock uh, on the tent pad at the conservatory. Then we have music in the gardens on Thursday featuring the Anthony Halbert Quartet. And so there's all kinds of things happening here at Hershey Gardens. Wow. So you definitely don't want to miss it. Well, awesome. So you heard it first, you know, 10 a.m. That's when this event starts. There's a plenty to enjoy uh, here at the gardens throughout the next month. So yeah, I'm having fun here just learning all about the trees. But now live in Dauphin County, Stone Meadows, Fox 43 News. And Sedona with the heat and humidity back, uh, hanging out under the trees, learning yeah. about them. <laughs> Good place to be in the shade. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks yes. so much, Sedona.